Tonight we are having veal chops with mushrooms and shallots and we're going to have roasted baby red potatoes on the side. And I'm going to start off first by just dicing up some mushrooms. All right, so I've already done my mushrooms and my garlic, and I meant to show you guys that, but I kind of got ahead of myself a little bit. I didn't do too many mushrooms because I'm only cooking one veal chop. It's just me tonight. Um, and I'm gonna chop up a shallot. You see, I've already cut it in half and peeled it. I'm thinking I only need, gonna need half of it because I don't, don't have that many mushrooms, don't have that much garlic because I'm only doing, like I said, one veal chop. I'm gonna have to cut these a little bit finer. Okay, I've seasoned my veal chop with salt and pepper. I'm also gonna use some Agoya adobo seasoning. I'm gonna use smoked paprika. Yes, I'm using the Great Value brand, sorry. And I'm gonna use McCormick's roasted garlic and herb. And I've got my oil heating up in my cast iron skillet. I mixed all my seasonings in a bowl and I'm going to sprinkle it over the veal chop and, and pat them in before I put them in the skillet. All right, so what I'm going to do next is I'm going to put my veal chop slowly in the cast iron skillet, making sure to put it in away from me. And we're going to cook it until it gets a nice sear on it. And here is my veal chop, fresh out of the cast iron skillet. I'm letting it rest for a few minutes before I cut into it. And while I'm letting it rest, I'm going to prepare my mushrooms and shallots with a little bit of red wine. All right, folks, my butter is melting. So I'm going to add my mushrooms, shallots, and garlic and I've got a little sprig of thyme and, and rosemary as well. So let's do the mushrooms. We're gonna do the shallots. We're gonna do the minced garlic. Stir that all into the butter. And I'm just gonna add my thyme and my rosemary as a, as a fragrance. So there's my thyme. And there's my rosemary. All right, my mixture is good and sauteed. So I'm gonna add some wash your shit sauce. Yes, I know, I mispronounced it, so don't come at me. But every time I say this word, I get tongue-tied, so I call it wash your shit sauce, okay? And I don't measure, I just pour the crap in because I pretty much know how to judge measurements without actually measuring it. So I'm gonna use a little bit of red cooking wine. I don't, as you can see, I don't have a whole lot left. Wonder why. Oh, could it be because I cook a lot with it? Okay, well, that's it, folks. I'm going to have to go buy some more. So I'm going to cook all this down until it's reduced. And there you have it, folks. We have pan-seared veal chop with mushrooms, shallots, and garlic that was cooked in a red wine reduction sauce. 
sauteed in butter and the pan juices. And as you can see, I garnished it with Italian parsley and lemon. And here we have red baby potatoes that were roasted in garlic infused olive oil and it was seasoned with roasted garlic and herbs and black truffle butter. Bon appetit.